Hi folks, welcome to AVC. Today's going to be a quick juice review. I got sent quite a few juices a little while ago from Caledonian Vapes here in the UK. I'm going to do three in this review. The three today are going to be the pan or chocolate, pistachio ice cream, and Murray's Triple X Mints. All of these are going to be 80, 20 VGPG, um, 3 milligrams in strength. It's going to be my usual derringer as always. It's going to be a 0.34 on coal. The first one I'm going to try today is going to be the pan of chocolate. Now the pan of chocolate is being described as a sumptuous dark chocolate encased in a soft, fluffy pastry. Go fight at 35 watts. So yeah, let's try pan of chocolate. Now this one is really a dark, bitter chocolate on the inhale. Yeah, there's nothing milky, creamy sort of chocolate like this. This is a real bitter, dark chocolate. Then mixing with that is going to be the pastry. The pastry is slightly sweet. A nice, light, fluffy taste, like he says, like a buttery, almost like a croissant with chocolate. Yeah, for me, it's more like a croissant. Split it in half, get some dark chocolate spread, put it inside it. This is really a nice, dark chocolate. Really rich, slightly bitter, and then slightly sweet with a pastry. But that one is really, really nice. That dark chocolate is really authentic. It's not chemically. It really is like a natural flavouring chocolate. And like I said, the pastry. If you don't really know about what pan of chocolate is, if you imagine the croissant, which you probably everyone to try the croissant pastry, very similar in flavour. Sort of buttery, light, crispy pastry and a dark chocolate inside. That one is really, really nice, guys. And that was the pan of chocolate. Let's try the next one. And here we are, second juice, which is going to be the pistachio ice cream. Now, on the website, this has been described as pistachios in a luscious ice cream base. So Moorish, it's hard to put down. Let's try pistachio ice cream. Can pump that one up slightly. Going to go to 38 watts. This one I've tried yesterday as well. It's a bit of a strange one. Sometimes on my initial inhale, I'm getting the pistachio nuts, but sometimes I'm getting the ice cream part first. But yeah, initially, this time, I'm getting a really nice pistachio nut flavour. There's no mistake in that for being any other sort of nuts. It's not like a peanut flavour. This really is a pistachio flavour. And then comes the ice cream afterwards. A nice creamy, maybe a hint of vanilla with it as well with this one. There is a slight coldness, but not very much. It's really not too cold of a vape. It's just a really nice pistachio nut mixed with the ice cream. I am tasting the cream, and I do think I'm tasting a slight hint of vanilla on the exhale as well. It's not overly sweet. It's not a sweet ice cream. Those pistachio nuts, if you've ever tried them before, they're kind of bitter in their own way, but really nice, blending nicely with the ice cream. And again, another smooth vape. The first one, the pan of chocolate, that was a really smooth, velvety sort of vape. And so is this one. This one, I can vape all day, quite easy. Like I said, I am getting a slight coldness in my throat, but not much. It's not overly cold, but really pleasant, 
really, really authentic pistachios. Yeah, that one I do like as well. Let's try the last one. Okay, the last flavour, which is going to be the Murray's Triple X Mints. If it will focus on me. There we go. Murray's Triple X Mints. Now on the website, this has got a lot going for it. It says, imagine a creamy butterscotch, sweet blended with ice cold peppermints, and you've got the best Murray Mint imaginable. I like Murray Mints, so let's give this one a taste. Now with this one, I'm getting that peppermint straight away. A really strong peppermint and menthol flavour. I am tasting a slight butterscotch toffee note to it as well. But what I'm getting most is the peppermint and the menthol and probably a cool order. This really is a cold vape. It's a bit too much for me, but that's me personally. I don't mind a bit of menthol and I don't mind a bit of cool order. This one, if you like your really arctic sort of vapes, this one's really, really nice. So that menthol and peppermint hit your throat straight away. Like I said, in the back of it, I am getting the butterscotch. Slightly toffee sort of flavour. It's a bit like a mint and like a Werther's Original Sweetie in the UK, you know what they are, sort of mixed together. It's like a slightly creamy butterscotch toffee flavour, but mixed with a really strong peppermint and menthol. It's not one for me, but I can see that if you do like a nice menthol and a nice cold vape, you'll like this one. It really hits the back of your throat instantly. Nice cold inhale. Quite sweet as well, I must say. Sweet mint flavour, because of the butterscotch. That butterscotch is more like a sort of caramel toffee flavour for me. But yeah, that really is a nice, strong peppermint. A nice hint of menthol and a nice hint of cool order. This is one for you guys and girls who like a nice, cold, mentholated or a really strong cool order vape. Not for me personally, but I can see that you would like this one. So yeah, that was the Murray's Triple X Mints. So that was those three juices from Caledonia Vapes. I do have about another six more to review. I'm going to do three in each review of the next two weeks or so. He did send me about nine altogether in the end. Really nice juices. These three, like the last lot I did, the um, slushy ones, they are really a smooth, velvety vape. That PG and VG blend that they're using, it makes it a nice, smooth inhale. Sometimes you get some vapes that are slightly harsh. None of these juices, either these three or the last three that I've tried, I've had any sort of harshness to the foot in the back of my throat. Just a really nice, velvety, almost cotton-like, I said last time as well. Really is a nice, really nice, smooth vape. But this one, the Murray's Triple X Mints, you do need to like a nice cold, mentholated vape mixed with a nice butterscotch, they're saying. For me, it's a bit like a caramel toffee sort of combined, which is very similar. Butterscotch, caramel and toffee, very similar in flavours. That one will clear your nose really, really well. So yeah, that was us three from Caledonia Vapes. As you know, I can't put a link down below in my description for any third party sites, but down below is a link to my website. On the website is, of course, going to be a vendor's page. On the vendor's page, Caledonian Vapes is already there. Really nice juices. Again, three out of three. And last time, three out of three. The only one I wouldn't recommend for a person who doesn't like menthols is the Murray Mints. But like I said, if you like a nice, cold, mentholated vape, you'd like that one.
So yeah, guys and girls, hope you liked the video. Did you like the video? Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done already. And yeah, I'm going to say to you, like I always say to you, every time, I will see you all next time.